Mass diversification to avoid risk is ludicrous. Algorithmic trading is everywhere. It's been around forever. Um, Kelly was on the forefront of that back in the 80s when people started building it, the computers doing the trading. An algorithm is simply, come on, go. It's just a simple set of rules that you give a computer to execute on. Make sure I'm on time. Good. Simple set of rules. So I'll, I'll give you a, the easiest algorithm ever. You could program a computer to do this. If Apple goes up by $1 off its opening price, buy it. No other rules. The computer could do that over and over and over again. Does that make sense? Mm -hmm. Okay, that's an algorithm. Now, obviously, there's a lot more complicated algorithm. Simple. Artificial intelligence is not that. Although artificial intelligence is an algorithm, a couple differences. Artificial intelligence is basically an algorithm that can change its own rules. What do you mean it can change its own rules? Let me tell you how it works at Flip. We have things called smart folios. I'm going to show you this here in a second. What an innovative smart folio is, it's a group of stocks or ETFs that Kelly originally created. Each one inside. And I'll give you the simplest one. I think it's called SPY Plus. It has Apple and the S&P. Spider. See, two things in the whole smart folio. That diversification thing, that's also a myth. Mass diversification to avoid risk is ludicrous. The more diversified you are inside the stock market, the more your portfolio will behave like the market, which helps you absorb the great big risks. Same thing. When you think about what a smart folio is, each of those strategies, the core strategies and, and the additive ones too, have a bank of stocks inside of them. Each of those has an algorithm. Nothing special or fancy about it, except that Kelly wrote it. That makes it pretty good. But that algorithm, every morning, as it goes to make the decision whether to buy or sell, it doesn't report to Kelly. It reports to the AI algorithm. And if they both don't agree, it doesn't move. So it's no longer human emotion. Maybe Kelly got up on the wrong side of the bed, his Apple phone died and he's mad at Apple. And even though the AI says buy it, he's like, screw this piece of junk, we're not buying that thing. That doesn't happen. So as you watch the little diagram how it goes, the AI uses cash as a hedge. So it'll just pull you out until tomorrow or the next day or the next day. This is not day trading. The smart folio on average, a whole smart folio, is only going to make six or seven trades a year. It's not about timing the market, getting in and out. It's about being ahead of the dips, getting out before they happen. You know, COVID was perfect for us. It took 85% of the money on our platform out, the AI did, on December 28th, 2019. Pretty predictive. Went back in. March 17th, you guys know the markets? That's like, wow, yeah, I mean, that's, you couldn't have, we couldn't have picked it better. You couldn't back test it and make it better. And that's real performance with real money.